Hello kids! Welcome to Kindergarten! It's me again, Teacher Frel! Kids, do you know the five senses? What are the five senses? Correct! These are eyes, ears, nose, mouth or tongue, and the skin. Our eyes is used for seeing. Our ears is used for hearing. Our nose is used for smelling. Our mouth or tongue is used for tasting. And our skin is used for touching or feeling. Last time, we have learned about the different senses. The sense of seeing, which is the eyes. The sense of hearing, which is the ears. And the sense of smelling, which is the nose. For today's topic, we will be going to learn about the sense of tasting which is the tongue. So our tongue is used for tasting. So our lesson for today is my tongue sense of tasting. Kids, let us hear again a Bible verse from Zoe. Our Bible verse for today is from the book of Proverbs 22 verse 6. Zoe, what is our Bible verse? Hi guys, Proverbs 22 6. Train up the child in the way he should go. When he is old, he will not be problem. Bye. Very good, Zoe. <laughs> now, kids, can you recite the Bible verse 2? Repeat after me Proverbs 22 verse 6. Train up a child in the way he should go. And when he is old, he will not depart from it. Can we recite again? Proverbs 22 verse 6. Train up a child in the way he should go. And when he is old, he will not depart from it. Very good, kids! <laughs> Most Essential Learning Competencies Name the five senses and their corresponding body parts. The next sense organ is the tongue. What is your tongue for? Why is it important? Your tongue is your sense organ for tasting. Inside your mouth is your tongue. Your tongue is used for tasting. It is covered with taste buds. Taste buds can tell the taste such as sweet, sour, salty, bitter, and spicy. Your tongue must be wet so that your taste buds can work. Your tongue can taste sweet foods. These foods are sweet like sugar, ice cream, cake, Honey, candies, watermelon. These foods are sweet. Your tongue can taste salty foods. These foods are salty, like salt, dried fish, fish sauce. Soy sauce, salted eggs, 
shrimp paste. These foods are salty. Your tongue can taste sour foods. These foods are sour, like kamyas, vinegar, dalandan, tamarind, and kalamansi. These foods are sour. Your tongue can taste bitter foods. These foods are bitter, like unsweetened coffee, ampalaya, unsweetened tea, and unflavored medicine. These foods are bitter. Your tongue can also taste spicy foods. These foods are spicy like chili, ginger, pepper, garlic, and menthol candies. These foods are spicy. Caring for our tongue. Your tongue makes you taste different kinds of food. Here are the examples of the kids eating different kinds of food. Here are some ways you can take care of your tongue. Brush your tongue also when you brush your teeth. Avoid licking or poking your tongue with sharp things. Avoid eating very hot or very cold foods quickly. Avoid eating too much spicy foods. Let us practice. Tell me if the food is sweet, sour, salty, bitter, and spicy. First picture. What is the taste of a chili? Correct! It is spicy. Second picture. What is the taste of a fish sauce? Correct! It is salty. Third picture. What is the taste of a vinegar? Correct! It is sour. Fourth picture. What is the taste of an unsweetened coffee? Correct! It is bitter. Fifth picture, what is the taste of an ice cream? Correct, it is sweet. Next picture, what is the taste of a kamyas? Correct, it is sour. Next picture, what is the taste of an ampalaya? Correct, it is bitter. Next picture, what is the taste of a cake? Correct, it is sweet. Next picture, what is the taste of a ginger? Correct! It is spicy! Next picture. What is the taste of a salted egg? Correct! It is salty! 
Very good kids! Kids, let's review. What is the sense of tasting? Correct! This is the tongue. And our tongue can taste sweet, sour, salty, bitter, and spicy. I hope you enjoy our lesson for today. See you next time, kids! Bye-bye!